In this interesting question, we have two circles touching a line segment at point A and point B and touching each other at point C. A line segment BD is drawn passing through point C. If the length of this red and green line segment is 9 and 16 cm, exciting part is using this limited data, we have to find radius of this bigger circle. Let's check the solution. With respect to this blue circle, from point B, we have BA as tangent and BD as secant. So applying secant tangent theorem, we get BA square is BC times BD. Here the length BC that is 9 cm and BD is 9 plus 16 or 25 cm. So putting these values here and solving it to get length BA as 15 cm. So this length BA, this is 15 cm. Now let's join AC. So we'll find the length of AC here first. For that, let's draw a common tangent passing through point C. And here we'll prove that angle C is 90 degrees. So for that from point E, we have two common tangents EA and EC is drawn on blue circle so they will be equal in length and same from point E EC and EB are the two tangents drawn on this brown circle so by theorem they will be also be equal in length so these two triangles are isosceles triangle so if this angle here is alpha degrees this will also be alpha and if this angle is beta degrees then this will also be beta degrees and in this triangle ABC if we'll see 2 alpha plus 2 beta is 180 or we can say that alpha plus beta is 90 degrees. So this alpha plus beta or angle C here is 90 degrees. Now in this triangle ABC, it's a right angle triangle. So applying Pythagoras theorem, we get AC square plus 9 square is 15 square. Solving it will get value of AC as 12 cm. So this length AC is here is 12 cm. Now here this remaining angle. So this is 90 degrees. Let's join DA. We know that in a circle if a chord subtends an angle of 90 degree then that chord is a diameter. So basically this length DA this will pass through center of circle and thus DO is R and OA that is also R. Now here this it's a right angle triangle that's triangle DAC it's a right angle triangle. Applying Pythagoras theorem we get hypotenuse square that is 2R square is 16 square plus 12 square. Solving it we'll get value of 2R as 20 centimeter and R as 10 centimeter and that's our answer. I hope you enjoyed the solution. I will see you in next video. Till then, tata, bye bye.